Hey, how you doing? It's uh, been a while. It's been like a month and a bit, I'd say. But yes, first week back at university now. I went out, obviously. To me, it's a bad thing, to be honest. And yes, let's get back into the uni flow. Enjoy. Call up Dr. Seuss, I think they running out of rhymes now. Chugging and finessing, we've heard that a hundred times now. Niggas keep repeating, they so like they in a vine, in a vine, in a vine now. Why they got a lot of Say them diamonds dancing, homie, we know that it's rhymes now. I'm back doing the vlogs again. Oh, this will be fun. Get back into routine. On a good note, I woke up kind of easy today, so it's fine. Even though my uni's at 12, so I could wake up at 10, but on Thursday, I have uni at 9, so I have to wake up at 7. That's gonna be fun. Let's go to university. Let's, let's see the gang. These guys are already back to shopping. And we're already going back to the boring. Jack again. Hi, Jack. Cutting through Aston, freezing cold. And now I'm back from university. I finished uni at two. Only just get back now at twenty past seven. That's mainly because I was at my course mates' flat. We watched a film and then just hung out, talked. Now it's time to make some food. I'm starving. I've been back a couple hours and done nothing except eat and binge watch Scorpion on Netflix. And that's about it for now. Uh, I'm running a tad late. Second day back. This is some good. 12, 12, 3 today. I have tomorrow off, then Thursday. I'm in from like 9 till 2, I think. Literally, I blend into the background. That's okay. There we go. But now it's too dark. And now I am back from uni. It was a long, long dragging day just because of the fact that. Normally I'm at my course mates flat during the break, however, basically my course mates with flat were normally in. She was going out with some other course mate to like a meal and then go watch a film, so we didn't have flat to chill out in. So we had to stay in uni, which is long, which is what normal people do, they stay in uni during the breaks. However, normally we just always go to the flat, chill in uni, went to the seminar, and now as always it's time to eat. Realised I haven't vlogged since I come back from uni and that was like maybe 5-6 hours ago. Still getting used to doing this again. Some of my flatmates are going out I think, they're going to prison, because some special guest is there. And I'm not going because one, don't really know many of the guys' songs. Don't you let out the antidote. Yeah. No other way to say it, but I'm going out. <sighs> don't need the glasses. Can't even say my flatmates have convinced me to go out. It's been a long time since I went out, okay? It's been at least a month and a half. Which, you know, for some, it's just no more thing. I went out every week, first term, which isn't a good thing, I'd say. It's not, but. Going based off past advice, I should include me not so sober, apparently, because apparently it's funny. Uh, that's that now. Currently 3 a.m. on a Wednesday morning. Um, waiting for Pablo. God knows where he is. It's way too cold to wait for him. So I'm going back to IQ. Okay, I'm all way back to IQ. Well, tonight was not expected at all. Even bought tickets to see J Hus, the event that was there, and then that got denied. So we then went to Indie Bar. Met some of my course mates there. Literally was about to go into the shower. Then my uh, course mate messages me saying. We got our results back from a presentation we had to do. Uh, we got a 2-1, which I'm um, mixed emotions about that. It's good because you know it's a 2-1, but probably should have got first for sure. I'm content with it, but yeah, 2-1 will do. Come back from the gym, showered, now I need to make some food. Yesterday, oh, I mean yeah, in the end I met some course mates at Indy, but still, I wanted to go to prison. Indy's okay. Going to make an omelette and fish fingers with some green tea because I'm kind of hungry after gym. And I haven't eaten much today, it's like 3 p.m. right now which is a normal thing. People don't eat that much at three o'clock during the day. I normally have maybe two, three meals by this time. Too many, my friends. Just put my clothes 
on the washing machine. That should be done in about 40 minutes time. I'm just feeling depressed about tomorrow, the fact that I have my first 9 a.m. Just got my results back from another module I did last term. Uh, two one, that two. Two one is, is better than fine. I thought I did so bad in that one, but yeah, two one's decent. Two module grades back. Both are two ones. One of them should have been the first, to be honest, but you know, I'm not petty. So I'm freezing again, just went outside because just things. And now I'm making some food. It's been offered to go out tonight, but probably not going to. I 9 a.m. tomorrow, two hours of maths on a morning. And the fact that I went out yesterday, and if I go out today, there'll be three days in a week because I'm going out tomorrow for snobs. So <laughs> I can't be doing that. 8 a.m., minus two. Not the fun way to start my first 9 a.m. of the year. Going to gym now. Check. Just got back from uni, it's cold as hell outside. I was almost falling asleep in my lectures. I only had like four hours sleep. One of the people on the course was like, oh, so Sonny, how are you? I was like, I'm tired. And then on the course was just like, Sonny, tired? It's a running joke. I always sleep in the breaks of my seminars and lectures. If you haven't noticed from past videos, and then I'll either eat now, then sleep, or sleep and then eat. <laughs> Just realized I started recording in like this. Um, I made beans on toast, and the beans spilled everywhere on my shirt, so wearing a gown. Well, I just did something really embarrassing. Went to clean my room, so I put the rubbish in the bins. Come back into my flat, open my room door, realized now this. The wrong flat, the wrong room, crap. What made it worse is that I walked in and then two of the girls who live upstairs were just on the bed talking. I was like, yep, okay. But before that, they both screamed. They were both like, what the hell? I was like, oh crap, my bad. They're like, okay, it's fine. Because luckily we've spoken to them before so they sort of know of us. Yeah, as I was closing the door, they were like, did you dye your hair? Because they saw me with my blonde hair. I was like, yeah. Cut it off a couple of days ago. And they're like, oh, okay. As I was closing the door again, I was just like, sorry, my bad. Because I came in the room pretty fast as well. They must have been like, what the hell's going on? Some random guys walking in, but luckily it's fine. Embarrassing though, embarrassing. I think it's, I've done it before, I've walked into the flat, thinking it was mine, not looking at the door number, just walking into the kitchen, being like, this isn't our kitchen, this kitchen's way too clean. The two girls were literally in the room talking, and I was like, oh, I have made a mistake here. Something embarrassing for the day. It's fun. How am I a snake? Recording this today goes, ah, oh, two seconds, I'll call you back in five minutes. That five minutes still hasn't come. I was, no, I forgot, I was talking to people, so I forgot. You don't forgot. want to talk to me, just say it. I'm kind of cold right now. It was an okay night, but in the same sense, it was a weird night too. Um, let's see what time I wake up tomorrow. It's currently like quarter to six in the morning. I'm actually so glad I never get hangovers. Like, that's a blessing, regardless of how much I drink. Which, you know, isn't a lot. Actually, reminds me. Um, over the Christmas holidays, uh, my flatmate messaged in our, like, flat group chat. Oh, Sonny, my dad says you drink way too much alcohol. I was like, what? Because in my vlogs, I go out a bit, you know? And people see that and they assume, drink, look, I don't. I really don't. I drink a small amount, but it's a strong small amount. It's not just fine. I was supposed to go on Cosmos Priest, but um, that didn't end up happening. I just remember one thing. Um, <laughs> I was at the bar getting water, and I'm cool, right? Near the end of the night, I just had like two, three cups of water. So I was there talking to, I think it was with one of my flatmates. Turn, this girl comes up to me, trips, and then she goes, I just, I broke up with my boyfriend yesterday. I was like, uh, I'm just gonna, just gonna walk away. Nothing I can say to that. Sorry about that, but um, okay. I was just thinking, okay, well, your rebound, somewhere else, not, not here. Minus four, we walked back. To be honest, it's minus four now, apparently. I'm wearing shorts. I had a job last summer at Tesco's. During like settling into Tesco's and the first week, I obviously got to know some of the people that worked there. 20 of us basically my age, all starting. I see one of my ex work colleagues at Snobs. I figured, hey, I haven't seen you in like months. I'll go say hi. You know, I'm a social guy. I tap her on the shoulder. She turns, looks at me, and just looks away. I'm like, you think I'm a random guy trying to... No. I was just like, you know what? I can't even be bothered to explain. I was just like, that's awkward. 
That's awkward, but funny. I'm just trying to be social. Say hi to someone that I knew. That didn't work out. I need to get some milk. So going out in this freezing cold weather now. Fuck off, man. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you for watching. If you liked it, give a like. If you like, I'll maybe put more editing into this terms of videos just because it makes it more visually appealing. Yes, I will see you next week when I do whatever it is I'm going to do. I don't know yet. But yes, thank you for watching. Crazy Peace. Mother.